a huge complex of 500 standing stones have been found in Spain. This is a picture of Karnak, northwestern France. The huge megalithic complex, more than 500 standing stones, has been discovered in South Spain, which could be one of the largest in Europe, according to archaeologists telling uh, Associated France Press. The stones were discovered in a plot of land in Huelva, a province which flanks the southernmost part of Spain's border with Portugal near the Guadiana River, spanning some 600 hectares, that's 1,500 acres. The land had been earmarked for an avocado plantation, but before granting the permit, the regional authorities requested a survey in light of the site's possible archaeological significance and revealed the presence of these stones. This is the biggest and most diverse collection of standing stones grouped together in the Iberian Peninsula, said Jose Antonio Linares, a researcher at Huelva University, one of the project's three directors. It's likely that the oldest standing stones at the La Torre La Janera site were erected during the second half of the, or of the 6th or 5th millennium BC, so it could be about 7,000 years ago. He said it's a major megalithic site in Europe. At the site, they found a large number of various types of megaliths, including standing stones, dolmens, mounds, coffin-like stone boxes called cysts, and various enclosures. Standing stones were the most common finding, with 526 of them still standing or lying on the ground. This is what the researcher said in an article published in Trabajos, de Prehistorica, a prehistoric archaeological journal in the Iberian Peninsula. The height of the stones was between 1 and 3 meters, that's 3 to 10 feet tall. They're excellently conserved at Karnak in northwest France, which is one of the most famous megalithic sites in the world. There are some 3,000 standing stones, and this is the images we have here. One of the most striking things was finding such diverse megalithic elements grouped together in one location and how well preserved they were, said Primitiva Bueno, co-director of the project and a prehistory professor at Alcala University near Madrid, Spain. And she told Associated France Press, finding alignments and dolmens on one site is not very common. Here you find everything all together. Alignments, cromlechs, and dolmens, and that is very striking, she said, hailing the site's excellent conservation. An alignment is a linear arrangement of upright sto standing stones along a common axis, which a cromlech is a stone circle, and a dolmen is a type of megalithic tomb, usually made of two or more standing stones, with a large flat capstone on top. Most of the meniers were grouped into 26 alignments and two cromleks, both located on hilltops with a clear view to the east for viewing the sunrise during the summer and winter solstices and the spring and autumn equinoxes, the researchers said. Many of the stones are buried deep in the earth. They will need to be carefully excavated with the work scheduled to run until 2026, but between this year's campaign and the start of next year's, there will be a part of the site that can be visited, Bueno said. And this is on FIS.org by Associated France Press. Please leave your comments. Thank you for your support. Kindly support my Patreon account. The daily posts are five videos daily, and they are totally different from what I have on my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for your support and that you find all my content so interesting. You'll find the Patreon account details in the description box below.